Hello everyone. This video training series is going to show you how to create a squeeze page out of one of the videos in the customer review videos library. Uh, the video we're going to use is Halo 3. I'm a video game junkie and Halo 3 just came out this week and it topped all the charts. In fact it even beat out Harry Potter in the entertainment industry. So let's use Halo 3. If you log in to customer review videos and you are a platinum member what you will see under each video in the featured section at the top is a link called use it click the link and you can click this link for any video in the library whether you've added the video or somebody else has added the video and a pop-up box is going to appear it's going to show you the squeeze page builder and a squeeze page is simply, as you can see in these template examples, is it's a one video landing page. So you're going to promote it uh, any way you can, email, blogs, forums, articles. You're going to create a link. Somebody's going to follow the link. They're going to come to this page. It's going to have a very specific purpose. And the purpose is, as you can see, collecting a name and an email address from the person who comes there. The purpose is to build a targeted email list so that you can continue. So first of all, you know what they're interested in. It's it's one video that they're either interested in that subject, that topic, that product, that service, or they're not. And if they're interested enough based on the video and the other information that you provide to sign up for your list, then you know that they're a targeted customer for that type of product or service. So you can continue to add value to them in the future by giving them more content and directing them to other products or services that are similar that they may be interested in. So the first step is we currently have three different templates, uh, the video with the bullets next to it, uh, video with the autoresponder next to it, etc. I'm going to go ahead and choose template two for this one. And to save us time, I've actually created a list of all the information that I'm going to include. So if you just bear with me as we move through this. First thing is the title. Uh, want to give an appropriate title to the head page. This is not the headline. This is actually the title of the page. It's the part that will appear at the top. It's the part that the search engines look for. Second one is the meta keywords. In this case, again, um, you know they're not as useful as they used to be, but they still are relevant, especially on some search engines. So, things that would be relevant here would be Halo 3, Halo 3 Review, Halo 3 Videos, or Xbox 360, which is what the video is, uh, game is for, or video game reviews. Those are things that people may be looking for, may be searching for, and are related to the subject of this page. The meta description, again, some people argue one way or another. I think it's valuable because it is what will come up in the search engine. If they see the search, uh, they see the title, they see a description, this is what they're going to see most likely. Halo 3 review video. Make a better buying decision by watching the Halo 3 review video for the Xbox 360. I think that would make people say, yeah, let me go watch that before I make a decision. Uh, on something like Halo 3, you pretty much either know if you want it or you don't, but anyway, you get the point. Now, down to the headline. This is the headline for the page itself. So when they hit the landing page and the title displays at the top or the headline displays at the top, this is what it's going to be. We then have the option for up to five bullets. You don't have to add all five bullets. You can add one or as up to five, as many as you want. And again, 
again bear with me as I copy and paste this over still definitely quicker than if I was sitting there trying to type everything off the top of my head okay now we have something called the blurb um, sorry best thing that came off the top of my head as I was developing the system but it's basically on the page itself you're gonna have and I still have to retype some on the page itself if we scroll back up to the template there's just some marketing text it's it goes beyond the blurbs the bur the the headline grabs their attention the blurbs uh, or the bullets pull them in uh, they could immediately sign up for your autoresponder your list the marketing blurb just gives them a little bit more of a reason you, you could actually add to um, you know a, a take action kind of statement there you know be sure to sign up for this email list because and give them the benefit for signing up domain name the reason this is here is because you're gonna get you know the long URL that we're gonna give you to promote this landing page well obviously the only reason you'd be creating a squeeze page is because you're trying to use it for marketing efforts and you know you don't want to have that long URL you want to have something short and sweet now if you know how to go out and uh, upload a redirect page to your own existing website and, and do it that way you can certainly do it but one of the benefits is if you add a domain name here we're actually going to include it in the customer review videos resources page we're going to put up so if somebody's looking for video games or whatever the tag is of the video the category of the video we're gonna have a resource page for them that will give them a list of dom domains to go look at and if you add your domain in here then it will be included in that as well I am going to you and you can always include it at a later point you can edit everything on this page so for now I'm gonna bypass that but you know you could certainly add something in there like if you get your own domain I would go with something like um, Halo 3 video game reviews or Halo 3 review videos something that's talking about the entire it has the keyword it has review it has videos all of those very popular when people are looking for a product or service autoresponder code the one I use is actually called Web Business Wizard. If you click the link there, you'll go see that service. Um, this is your autoresponder. Uh, we don't take anything away from you. Uh, we believe that we are marketing partners. We believe that we are here to add as much value as we can to the consumers by providing the videos. But when it comes to our mar marketing services like building squeeze pages, we feel that we need to add as much value as we can to our marketing partners. So we're not limited, limiting you. We're not making you sign up for our service. We're not making you um, keep your customers' names and emails address in our database uh, we are not adding any links to it it is yours you sign up for your own autoresponder and you use it however you wish we're simply providing you the tool to help you build that list